and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a super exciting video. I'm going to be doing an easy kind of school spring makeup look. I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to call this, but just like an easy kind of natural makeup look. It's natural for me at least because I feel like I wear a pretty full face every day. So I kind of push myself to do a more natural makeup look. This is what it looks like. Um, I just did a really light layer of foundation and then I did a liquid highlighter and blush, which I'm absolutely obsessed with. I'm going to talk to you guys about that in the video. I'm actually partnering with Grande Cosmetics on this video to talk to you guys about their new product. They are so nice. They're plumping and they just look super, super nice. So I'm really excited to show you guys them. Obviously, I did not wear my fake eyelashes in this video. So I just have natural lashes, kind of glossy lips. So yeah, I just really hope you guys enjoy this makeup look and it's easy to recreate. That was my goal. Subscribe if you're not subscribed and make sure to turn on my notification bell. Um, follow me on Instagram at emilygrace.26 and let's just go ahead and get into the makeup look. Okay, so I'm gonna start out with foundation. Some days I haven't been doing foundation if my skin is already kind of clear. I do bake tan, but I've been using these little tanning drops on my face so my face can still be kind of tan with my neck. It kind of like helps maintain the tan on my face so that if I do wanna go without makeup, my face is still tan and kind of like matches my neck a little bit better without feeling like my face is a totally different shade than my neck. So that's just like a little trick that I've been doing lately. But I do like to wear foundation most days. Um, but what I've been doing is just wearing a lot less. So instead of like doing maybe two or three pumps, I'll just do one pump and do a really thin layer. I like to use the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation. It's just like a nice mix of natural, but it still covers all my imperfections. So just like applying a lot less than I normally would. And I think I'm gonna go get a hair clip really quick. Can I pull this off? I feel like I look like a kid. So as you can see, it's just like a really nice light natural layer so not anything too crazy it's really light natural so you can definitely still see my skin but it's just like a nice even base now i'm going to use this tarte shape tape concealer and that'll just brighten up my under eyes which is great during the school year because i literally get no sleep um i stay up to like 2 a.m every night and then i wake up at like 7 that's not too bad. So as you can see, that just brightened up my face a little bit under my eyes, on my forehead, down my nose, a little bit on my chin. So really quickly, I'm just going to use this Rimmel Stay Matte Powder to set where I just put the concealer because I feel like it'll crease really fast. And so I'm just gonna use this little setting brush. And I'm not setting my whole face, I'm just setting where I put the concealer. So now I'm going to use a couple products that I'm really excited to talk to you guys about. It's by a brand called Grande Cosmetics, and it's their Grande Glow, which is a liquid plumping highlighter, and then Grande Pop, which is a liquid plumping blush. So Grande Pop, which is the blush, it provides a soft, diffused pop of color that leaves your skin feeling fresh and dewy all day long. And it has a lightweight buildable formula that is infused with a rapid skin lifting system called Thin Up. There's Grande Glow, which I'm also going to be using as a pearlescent formula that provides moisturizing and plumping to your skin, which gives you a radiant glow. So both of these are going to lift, plump, and illuminate your skin, which is just so cool. I feel like not very many products are going to not only make your skin look good, but like plump and lift your skin. And they have powerful ingredient complexes, so I'm going to talk about the ingredients that are in it. It's going to have like a comfortable cooling sensation once you apply it. Firms and tightens fine lines it also hydrates your skin which gives it a nice like dewy look you'll have like a nice silky weightless texture on your skin and the applicator is just really easy to use it's like a nice like kind of like dab and go so you can just like use it really easily so the key ingredients are vinop lift which is an ingredient derived from swiss ice wine so what it does it visibly lifts plumps and hydrates your skin for smooth cushioned appearance and the other ingredient is gadolin radiance and this will just boost your skin's radiance and luminosity rather than it looking like dull so grande glow is good for all skin tones there's three different shades and they're all they're good for all skin tones the grande pop has a variety has quite a variety of shades so i have sweet peach which is like the right in the middle shade you're gonna just use the applicator to apply it to the apple of your cheeks and then just dab it in with your finger you'll feel an instant lifting and tightening within like one to two minutes you can do it like over makeup like obviously i already have makeup on or you could just apply it to your natural skin i don't like to apply liquid products over powder that's why i only put a powder underneath my eyes so this part is just like my foundation this is very similar you just want to dab it onto the high points of your face so like your cheeks nose cupid's bow chin so like all kind of like and then kind of like a similar thing, dab it in with your finger. So you can purchase these online at Grande Cosmetics, grandecosmetics.com, or you can also get them at Ulta, and Ulta's website or in stores. I'm gonna start with Grande Pop, the blush. I'm just going to apply that on the apples of my cheeks and dab it in with my finger. 
love this color. I just think it looks really nice. And it does feel like super nice and cooling on your face. Okay, so I'm do the same thing on the other side. Love the way it feels. Okay, so now I'm gonna do the highlighter, Grande Glow. And I have to say, I'm really picky with highlighter colors and even blush, but I really, really love the color of these. Like the shades are really nice. So that's what it looks like. I just love the cooling and plumping sensation. I just think it looks so nice. I love that highlighter. It's like natural, but you can still definitely really see it. So now I'm gonna use my Rimmel Stay Matte Powder and go ahead and set the rest of my face. And I'm just gonna be really careful to just pat it so I don't mess that, any of that up. Now I'm gonna go ahead and do my bronzer and I'm just gonna use the Hula Bronzer. So now I'm gonna go ahead and do my eyebrows. Oh, and I'm using the Anastasia Brow Duo. battery died. I know my eyebrows look super dark and way different than they looked before I did them, but my eyebrows are super non-existent and really, really light. So I like to fill them in to match my hair and yeah, this is just how I like to do them. But um, then I like to go over them with the Glossier Boy Brow and Clear. Um, I just really like the texture that this adds to my eyebrows. Okay, so now we are going to just do a little bit of eyeshadow. Let me just do this little morphe palette i'm just going to do this color right here it's called hang 10 I'm going to apply that in the crease and i'm just going to use this color called sunny's now i'm going to just apply some mascara you could do like a little eyeliner flick if you wanted to but I think I'm just gonna keep it simple and just do mascara. I usually do false lashes just to keep like the easy, natural look. I'm gonna just do mascara for this video, but um, I do typically wear fake eyelashes. So I'm gonna curl my eyelashes so that way they just, you know, it looks better when I'm doing the mascara. And I'm just using this Maybelline Lash Sensational. Oh my gosh, I never, I really don't put much effort into my mascara usually because I'm wearing fake eyelashes, but Curling my eyelashes made such a difference. Also, I'm loving how this feels on my face, the grande pop and grande glow. I just love how this looks. My lips, I feel like my cheeks look really plump and just like, okay. So now I'm going to do some lip product. And I usually do liquid lipstick, but I want something kind of like glossy. I'm gonna try this uh, MAC Viva Glam 2 lipstick. Mm, not quite what I was going for. There's a little bit of that left, but I, that's not really the color I was going for. I think I'm just gonna go with this um, Marc Jacobs lip gloss in the shade Sugar Sugar. Mm, I like it. I feel so weird without my eyelashes. Lip gloss is actually plumping too, so I'm like all plumped up, you know? This is the finished look, so I'm just loving how this is looking. So that is what the finished makeup look looks like. I am absolutely loving the cheek color and the highlight color. It just looks so good. Like Literally look at that, and it also feels really good. My skin just feels like really fresh and just like hydrated, and it's like plumped. I can't describe the feeling, but it just feels so good. So definitely... Check these out. I think you guys will really, really love them. I just love how they apply, and they're also really pigmented. Um, so I just absolutely love those. So definitely check them out. I'm gonna have all the all the information linked below. But I hope you guys liked this natural, kind of easy makeup look, especially like for school or just a more kind of natural spring look. Definitely thumbs up if you'd like to see more makeup looks on my channel. And subscribe if you're not subscribed. And make sure to follow me on Instagram at emilygrace.26. Um, also, thank you to Grande Cosmetics for partnering with me on this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in my next one. Bye.